Multiple myeloma is a incurable blood cancer that produces a lot of proteins that can cause damage to various organs, particularly the bones as well as the kidney. There's a variety of symptoms. I think some of the really salient ones are progressive bone pain that is persistent and doesn't improve with time. This is really different from your usual muscle ache or back pain. It's usually in the hips and the back, but can affect any bone. I would say fatigue that is limiting to activities, recurrent infections that start to happen. It's so important to really understand the fundamentals of what is this disease, how is it treated, and what is expected from the side effects of treatment. There are multiple treatment options for multiple myeloma. It's best suited based on your risk of disease and your prognosis. Critical to always ask if there's a clinical trial available, even if it's right at diagnosis. Quality of life is critical. I think of cancer in uh, a way that you actively try to treat the disease and you try to mitigate the side effects of the disease as well as the treatment. We're really fortunate at Mayo Clinic to have some of the leading researchers who are really driving the science. Most um, striking and exciting would be the immune-mediated therapies, the chimeric antigen receptor T-cell or CAR-T therapy, as well as the bispecific anti-monoclonal antibodies, the antibody drug conjugates, and really those are showing revolutionary changes. What makes Mayo Clinic different to get myeloma treatment here is not only do you have access to the best care, the best resources, the best multidisciplinary practice that's integrated, so any other subspecialist that needs to support you are all available, as well as all of the novel therapeutics and that focus to help one patient. There's such devotion. Mayo is a beautiful example of what's created is focused entirely on supporting and meeting the needs of the patient.